We are looking forward to some live music tonight in Rochester and actually a little later right here this morning in studio award winning blues musician Sue Foley is with us. She's going to be performing tonight at Abilene Bar and Lounge, but we're going to get to know her first this morning. Good morning. Good morning. I love your jacket, by the way. Thank you. Yeah. And thanks for being here early. Yeah, it's it's. You know, we musicians love to get up at six it's, in the morning. It's <laughs> what it's what we have to do. The job requires it. But so good to have you stop by. Yeah. Uh, one of our first guests to be performing in studio live. Um, tell everyone where you're from. Uh, I'm originally from Canada, but I've uh, been based out of Austin, Texas, mm -hmm. for a number of years. And uh, yeah, um, so I'm a Canadian artist. I'm also a, known as a Texas blues artist. Yeah, I kind of started my career down in Austin. Okay, mm -hmm. what drew you to the blues? genre you know I just fell in love with it as a kid as a teenager I, I was into uh, you know a lot of my brothers were all into like heavy guitar music mm -hmm. like Zeppelin and the Stones yeah. and, and you know the Jimi Hendrix and Clapton that's kind of where the era I grew up in mm -hmm. and ZZ Top and um, all that stuff is really blues based so when I started um, I'm kind of a natural researcher so I started researching you know where these guys got all their ideas mm -hmm. and, isn't it something? This, yeah, I discovered this whole world of blues when I was in my teens, and I yeah. just kind of went with that. A lot of the foundation is in blues or jazz. Yeah, what blues is, especially. Yeah. yeah. What inspires you as you're writing your music? Well, I'm just inspired by human the human experience, mm -hmm. I guess, and that's what drove me to blues, too, is that it's, it's just a real honest music. Mm -hmm. It's about life. It's about... It's about the human experience and all its assets, be it joy or pain or, you mm -hmm. know, a lot of people think, oh, blues is just sad, you know, depressing. And yeah. it's not at all. It's yeah. actually what happened to me when I was a teen. I went to my first blues show in a, and that was in Ottawa. And that was James Cotton. You know, we used to have a lot of Chicago acts that mm -hmm. came up through mm -hmm. there. So we saw a lot of the, the legends that came up uh, when we were really young. But I, I just felt uplifted by mm -hmm. the music. And I realized that that power of... Uh, uplifting people in a live setting yeah. and how magical that moment is and 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 it, it affected me so strongly that I, I just dedicated my entire life mm -hmm. to it at 15 years old. Well, it's something you, you say know? that at such a young age that you were drawn to it because, yeah. yeah, you mentioned people think, oh, it's sad and depressing or it's 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 for that older generation. Right. Um, but it spoke to you. How do you maybe kind of set that example or set apart for a younger generation to really get into this and say, hey, this is there's something here for you. It's not just the hip hop or, you know, the TikTok generation. There, there's something here for you in blues. Well, there really is. And the funny thing is, is, you know, and blues right now does have a bit of an older audience mm -hmm. because it comes out of that, um, that rock thing um, from the 70s. Mm -hmm. and, and a lot of people were blues. It was blues based, the same thing that got me into it. But when I see young people at my shows and they've never heard blues, they don't even know what they're hearing. I get that they're, you know, they're getting the same experience I got as a kid where you're getting some kind of connection and something real and somebody's talking about real life mm -hmm. and experiences you want to know about. You yeah. know, we want to know about love. We want to know about life and death and all these these things that make us human and bring us together. Yeah. Um, that, yeah. That's special. And I think that's, that's great about art and music, how it, there's that connection to someone's life. And it could be a lifeline too as well. I, I want to point out that you were just nominated for three of the 43rd annual Blues Music Awards from the Blues Foundation, so congratulations Thank to you. you. Um, where can people find your music? Well, they find it all over the place, but SueFoley.com is my website and everything. Everything I got is there. So Awesome. Well, you're going to have a chance to connect with our audience, uh, a younger generation as well, across all generations and age groups here. Um, stay with us because you're going to hear Sue Foley perform. Uh, and I know you got some time to warm up and everything. Uh, first, though, Matt is going to check in with the Weekend Buzz crew, Scott and Sandy. We'll be right back. How about a little blues with your sunshine? Mm -hmm. We're about to get treated to some music from Sue Foley, who is with us ahead of her performances tonight at Abilene Bar and Lounge. Get your tickets now. Uh, late last year, Sue, I know that uh, you dropped your new album, yep. Pinky's Blues. Pinky's Blues, yeah. Uh, are you going to play a little bit from that album? Um, I'm actually going to play something else because uh, Pinky's Blues was an electric album okay. with, with the band, and they just couldn't get out of bed this morning. <laughs> it's just me. <laughs> well, where can people get that album? Uh, uh, anywhere, actually. It's all streaming. It's called Pinky's Blues. It's a, an electric blues album. 
Um, so it's on every, every streaming format, platform. my website, suefoley.com, everything. Yeah. Perfect. Check her out. What are you going to play for us now? This is, uh, yeah, dedicated to us. We're going to Memphis for the Blues Awards. So this is a song about Memphis. All right. Take us on yeah. that journey. <laughs> Take a little walk with me Come on Take a little walk with me Back to that same old place Memphis, Tennessee One and one is two Two and two is four. I'm heavy loaded, baby. I'm booked, I got to go. I'm saying, hey, take a little walk with me. Back to that same old place. Memphis, Tennessee. Oh, let's go. performing tonight nine o'clock at the Abilene Bar and Lounge that's on Liberty Pole Way you just took us on a journey I you know what I felt from that I felt a hot summer oh, down yeah. south Let's on an open it. porch with some sweet tea All right, that sounds like a good time. <laughs> I feel that I wish you the very best have a great show tonight thanks for stopping by enjoy getting to know you a little bit and I'm sure our viewers did too one more time where can they find your album suefoley.com or just yeah just look me up check Google, her out Google it hey the blues it's in it's so cool thank you so much Thanks local for headlines us. coming up next <laughs> 